Hey, Bobo. We're gonna get these peeps married. After they eat breakfast, of course. Okay. Here we are with Natasha Una and her art studio and her home business. That's all she has been doing. She is just unemployed. Uh, she recently got very serious with Vic Vector, the <coughs> store owner I made for the game store lot. Um, and so they have moved in together. And I thought I locked Get Married for her. I think she did want it, but somehow Werewolf got relocked again. Um, but we're going to do their wedding today. I don't know if they want kids. Did I give him? I give him secondary knowledge and Natasha is secondary grilled cheese. So. Honestly, Bubba, I'll take a break from kids <laughs> right now, considering what happened last night. Uh, anyway, uh, we will see if their feelings change after they get married. They usually do. Like, it's like, get married and then have a baby. So... Is this going to be... Oh, no. This is not our first wedding. Uh, John Mole and Melody Stream was the first wedding. Shall we do a date beforehand? Have him do a date. He wants to become a witch. What? Honestly, I think Natasha's better suited to become a witch, but she wants to be a werewolf, so I don't know. We'll see what happens. All right, we've got to figure out like a nice wedding area thing. That is a fancy table. Fancy chairs too. Move objects off. Oh, I see. It's not going to like that. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, in the corner. Then you'll have a thing right there, a chair right there. Then we'll have, we'll put the arch on the deck over here. And then we should have a good cinematic view of the whole thing. Oop, the dog's here. Don't chase him off. Shoe pet. You already considered a pet? 
We are good friends. We have greeted him. Be treat. Natasha, do you have any goods? We've got coupon for free meal. Cactus and vase. Cactus. Small vase. Nothing else. Ooh, you, you gotta get to work on some product. Alright, let's have her knit products. Oh, here's the knitting. Um, this one... Because I know there's, there's kind of two knitting mods for The Sims 2. Um... Let me see if I can find who did this one. I think this was a Tony Vice collaboration. If I remember right. And then the other one was Rebecca's. And I prefer this one. Uh... I prefer this one better because you, I think Rebecca's was only you knit and then there's like a pile of clothes that you can buy from. You can buy the knitted products from. But the uh, the only bug with the, the Tony Vice one is when you cancel the interaction, it'll automatically be added. So I could do, so I could have her do a perfect poof. And then as soon as he starts it, cancel it, and it'll be completed. She has to finish, like, an animation. But then, after she does one whole animation sequence, then the item is added. In a cooking skill point. She's already. Uh, okay. Dogs are getting into fights. Gotta grab this plate. Risky is still at 30. I'm just going to be checking that every single every single time now. Is the yard 100% weeds? Are weeds even allowed to spawn on the last square? Oh, yep. They can spawn on the last square. I think your lawn might be 100% covered in weeds. 
Oh, the dog broke the couch. <laughs> Luckily, there's another couch. Let's ask on a date. You can call it the weed house. <laughs> All that's missing is a bubble blower. Blung. The back rub flirt. Why a car just randomly shows up? I'm sure well werewolf is going to come up again. So I'm going to unlock it for now. A couple more romance wants, and then we'll we'll end the date and start a wedding. But who to invite? Probably the Aspers. That's really all she knows. Who again, Vic? Really? Mora Vaza. 
Nada. Domino Lee. The bills are here. Who are you? Lindsay Louie? I'll fix his aging later. Okay. <clears throat> For a wedding party, you need fancy arch. You need chairs to sit. Why do we even have that sofa? Let's get get a buffet. And I'll put the cake on that table later. Over here, answer the phone. I mode party. Or is it in? Hobby games. Thousand five hundred. Huh? Hey, Ayame. Thanks for thanks for following. Don't go to sleep. Hello. Why are you stuffing your face? Is it because you're super hungry?
Wait, like, do you even know the Aspers? Alice Elizabeth Pauline Victor. We are missing Lewis. Does Natasha know Lewis? Yes, Luis is her cousin, but he died. <laughs> He's dead now. Um, uh, when Elizabeth had uh, twins, it was a boy and a girl. And um, so the the boy twin is Lewis. Well, I suppose I will just teleport him over. Thank you for that info. Trav stores her memories. Met lots of people, got engaged. Does she even know? Oh, yes. She does know. Lewis died. As you can see, that was quite a while ago. Natasha, where'd you go? Just curling up into a ball. <laughs> All right, I guess Vic will throw the wedding party then because he is the one that wants the marriage. Three, four. And then I will teleport the other thing. Oh, the house is it your build? No, this is Natasha's uh, OG house. Um, I did wall off this front room and turn it into her shop. Uh, but the majority of it is uh, pretty untouched. Everyone's here. And everyone's going into the shop door. Alright. Is that the sim blender? Teleport. We need to teleport. Asper. Lewis Asper. There he is. Uh, all over. Introduce yourself. But this is this is little Lewis. I spelled his name a little differently so we could tell him apart. As long as you talk to people, it's going to be not bad. Oh, I have to set appearance, Lewis, clothing, formal. All right. 
Come on, Vic, let's get married. Married at sunset. Come on, Vic. Yeah, you can just come right through the back door. Oh, I suppose we have to unlock it. Vic? There you are. All right, and everyone's here. It's a good memory of getting married. So, couldn't be too bad. No, we're not going on a vac not on a on a thing. We're not going on a honeymoon. I already did that with one family and it was too long, man. What am I looking for? I'm looking for something. Oh yes, the family tree. Oh my goodness. Don't I have... What, what happened to Sims and their privacy? That's what I want to know. Oh, we got to serve food. I don't know. <laughs> They're not a call to meal. I guess there is not a call to meal. They do not show up in her family tree. I think it might be a little too distantly related for them to show up. How big can the family trees go? I wonder. Yeah, get inside. Elizabeth! Well, they're, I'm not in charge of them. Vic, you can stay inside, though. Several generations. Okay. Her and Louis share grandparents. Oh, 
Ah, there they are. I have found them. Oh, why why is why did she take his last name? I meant for it to be her last name, but whatever. Get her to recognize them as cousins. Family. Wedding party was a success. It shows up when you click family, it shows they all show up in here. Is that just because they're on the lot? No, they're not on the lot. Okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, don't do that. Take a shower. Under Vic. That is your wife. Why did you go in just to ex exclaim at her in the bathroom? You know what? I think I... Uh, Natasha ended up networking with a furniture discount person. So that is why we got money back on the buffet and the arch when we sold it. Because we were able to buy it at a discount from the catalog. Natasha, that's dirty plates. Clean that up and then go to bed. Alright, so how we're gonna play them is um we're gonna we're gonna play Vic at his shop, and then when we come back, we'll have yeah. See, there's the werewolf. Um, we'll have Natasha paint and sculpt on the second day, and then the third day she'll sell her stuff. And then on the fourth day, I don't know. We will see. So it is 6 a.m. We're going to try to get Vic out the door by 10.
Pick a taking a shower. Buy electronic entertainment. Buy a car. I probably could afford a car. Vic is a local business owner. So I was going to say after we get him breakfast, we'll send him to his store, but he is already full of hunger. His hunger bar is full. We are going to pay the bills. Go walk to our community lot. And Natasha, I'll have you make many pictures. Let's do those pictures. All right. <clears throat> so that's all set up. also wants to become a werewolf I don't think you have a chance okay my store need anything can I do a macro clean store. It's actually a uh, double story. The top is all tech and karaoke. There's no one here to play Mahjong. You're going to be sitting there for a while. Let's open business, call in employees. He just has one employee so far. I want to see if I can hire another one. Be the barista. Why are the professors walking in my lot? May I help you? Groofly 
We have a phone. Answer the phone. What's going on? Why is the Why is the business phone ringing? No, maybe like actually What? All right, our employee just quit. <laughs> All right. What? Yeah. is going to watch some TV. What are you staring at? What are you staring at up here that's for sale? Staring at something that's for sale? Weird. Hmm, yes. That wage? What? What? What just happened? What did you just buy? Did you did he buy something from the bottom shelf? Alright, well, we got a good review at least. We have multiple multiple best of the best awards. Yes, I'm coming, Trevor. Hold your horses. Barely paid. Christy. Mm. I don't know, man. <laughs> Daniel Bell is here. Oh my god, Yep, the customers. We've got to watch the time when we're playing this lot. These previous times I've played, I've just kept him here like for hours at a time. Sometimes even spending the night. <sighs> mm. But he actually has a family now, so gotta make sure he gets home on time. 
Huh? <laughs> Isaac and Daniel out for a father-son lunch date. I have set a Wii console for sale over here, but no one has um, no one has even attempted to look at it. Yeah, they're all for sale. That's weird. The old people are going to come by to play solitaire. Among other things. Bring up the customers. Vic. There you are. I'm hearing something. More information. Cash flow. Today, we are breaking even. Three twenty PM. I think we'll keep it open till about five. And then we'll send him back home. Three fifty six PM. How's his needs? Make yourself a lunch meat sandwich. Can do macro. He's deciding to eat in the uh, customer area. We'll close the business. Thank you for coming, everybody. Let's walk home. Whoa, that was another building. Oh, they smooching.
Uh, today is Una's, um, is Natasha's, like, stocking day. So we're gonna have her, I've already started her on making many clay pitchers. And maybe we'll make one teddy bear. One, two, three. And we're going with the green bear today. But, uh, all right, let's put, put the product out. I need my sledgehammer because we're getting rid of that and that and that. Uh, there we go. I'm just gonna sell that. There on display. Poof in the corner. Okay. Oh. I forgot the picture. Oh, I'll just have her restock the picture. Right, and then we have to set the bear for sale, set the poof for sale. Calls for cash flow. Employees cash flow. Okay, let's get some leftovers. Late. Did I never delete that back when she had her thing outside? You saw that, didn't you? There was a there's a salt sign. Well, I do have a small plate. Maybe I'll just restock it. And then I'll move it. My grabby hand. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Now, uh, Vic should be home soon. What else can she do? Do a paint and do some painting. Build bouquets is in the zone.
him. There he is. Clean up the destroyed sofa. I just realized Natasha does, does not have a TV. Does she have a TV? I think she might have. Back when this small area was a sitting room. Ah, oh, come on, Vic. Try to repair that. Does he have good mechanical? Yeah, he does. Noodle, stray cat. Tasha is busy painting. He is in the zone. Checking for tips. Zika? <laughs> Don't play for tips. <laughs> On home lots. I know I saw that. It's a dance kiss to say thanks for fixing the shower. <laughs> Dirty joke. <laughs> and then he's going to do a clean. She's going to go back to painting. Then we're going to do a casual bed woohoo. Whoa. There we go. Grilled cheese wands are coming in strong. Done their deed and now in bed. Oh, I thought they would go right back to sleep. 
Usually they do that. Let's see. No, don't relax. You go to sleep. Alright, we're gonna wake up and get some leftovers. Natasha could also use some leftovers. Let's see, Natasha got there first, so she's gonna have one of these, and then Vic got here, so he's gonna have this one. And then get another leftovers. Rick, Vic. This is Vic. She's in the shower. Whoop. Hi, Magic Toad. Thank you for following. Hmm. I really should have Vic go to the shop today. I don't know. It's 8 a.m. Natasha finished making this picture. It's gonna do a macro clean. Why does Vic have like Super dropping needs. That's what I want to know. I thought we paid the bills. Did we not? Yes, we did not. All right. I guess we're going to send him to work then. Do, 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 do. Walk to your game store and then when we get back we'll play Natasha's home store. Crafted goods. And it was like zigzag planter while we're gone.
finished loading up Gamer Saven. It's a game stored by games, electronics, play the party board games. Okay, we're going to need to hire some employees. No, I said hire employees for this lot. Okay. Hmm. All right. Your new staff is ready and waiting. Oops. All in employees. Where are my employees? Here they are. Management set uniform. There's your uniform. I might have to make her a new uniform. <sighs> yeah, it's loading in all the stuff. What am I looking for? Looking for the t shirts that I probably replaced with something. Oh, there's the t shirts. Hmm. Let's see how these bottoms work. Do I even have high rise bottoms? I don't think so. Oh, there we go. Um, but I think the other guy has khakis. There we go. Check. All right, you are going to assign to be a cashier. Cute work outfit. 
Oh. Peterson's looking for something? I think he is. Management assign. Assign to restock. And you are assigning to be cashier. Alright, they are at their jobs. I did build it, yes. Um, scrolling through TikTok, I came across this uh, guy who runs a small chain of shops called Gamers Haven, where it's like a manga and bookstore, a video game store, they have collectibles and in-person games and a ramen shop and boba tea. So this, that's where I got my inspiration for this whole thing. I think I have a, too many computers in here. There might be too many computers in here. All right, we are now rank six. All right, what should we do? Simply influential. Work up. Motivational speech. Yeah. I've played him a couple days on his own, but I haven't put him into... We're going to max out the wholesale, I think. I, I haven't put him into a real rotation until now, because... I don't know. I want a very specific way that the shop was run. So that's why I made him the owner of it. And he just so happens to have great chemistry with Natasha, so that's taking care of that. Alright. Management. Take a break. Also, take a break. Be a cashier. Thick. Phone's ringing? My phone's... My personal phone is ringing. Hello? Oh, it's the other business owner. It is 5 p.m. We're going to assign her to uh, 
Nah. Alright, after Trevor. Oh, never mind, we got one more. Nope. Closing the business. And sending employees home. Finish ringing up these customers, man. Who are you? It was not very productive. Alright. Walking home. And now it's time to do more customers. You're going to play Natasha's little shop. <laughs> because you're home in eight hours. All right, open your business. Let's see how well your sales do today. Oh, that's right. Two. Ah, stop it. Lock. Household only. Lock. Household only. Can I grab you? No, I will. Grab. <laughs> Lock. Household and employees only. Come over here and be a cashier. How did you get in the house? Come in here, stay a while. Play. Who's playing at the piano? Joy Hasu. <laughs> Excellent mime. We even have sounds. Oh. 
Man, Peter Sims is buying everything in our store. Music has stopped, but she's still going. <laughs> Mo track dead. The beach. Hmm. You exchanged money, right? Right. Peter. Hey, Natasha, is Vic available? No. Joy has glitched out. Job. Natasha, look up. Why do you go through my door? Well, Joy's head works. Mm -hmm. uh, never mind. Oh, uh huh. Oh, uh huh. Sharon Worth is here. Hello, Sharon. Buying new curtains. Okay. Turns out you have to put her back. You have to put her back on the piano. So she realizes that she's done playing. Then you can put her outside. Wow, quite a bit has quite a bit has gone. You actually made a bit of something. Meso, meso, my line to it. Stock that, restock that, restock that. Vic is home in two hours. <laughs> Why it needs this seat cushion. Uh -huh. And then when Vic gets home, we're going to close the store. Wow. Very nice. Thank you. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
Sales. Basic sale. Be a cashier. Nope, I guess not. Okay. Guess we're closing the store. Vicky is home anyway, so. Now get out of here. No. Don't play the piano. Just serve some grilled cheese. Your favorite. Oh, maybe we should have influenced Vic to do it. Another skill point, though. Turns out he was also hungry. Put away the leftovers. Take a shower. Is the bathroom? Where's my? Where'd my pen go? Oh, there it is. Ugh! Doop -a -doop -a. No way, leftovers. Cleaning up the plates. Um, this is not The Sims 4, Vic. You do not wash the dishes in the bathroom sink. Mm. Wow, it's 1 a.m. I did not realize it gets so late so fast. <laughs> Wolf's here. We're gonna miss the werewolf tonight, I think. Yeah. I'm having Vic do all the cleaning. He's sort of like in the middle about it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use today as another stocking day for Natasha because she sold a lot. So I suppose with Natasha we'll do one day of stocking, one day of, um, one day of store tending.
It is 8 a.m. Is the dog still here? No. The dog is not still here. Not that big. We are... Going to... Gamer's Haven. Natasha's just gonna paint all day. Good morning, everybody. going to be the cashier and you management you are going to tidy up Assigned to be cashier. You get to be the cashier today. May I help you? You are in an employee area. Sivu is looking for the alien alien figurine. Developing a new product. Here is a free sample. I got a free sample. What's my free sample? Woo! Large flat screen TV. Nice. All right. You, Miss Tamara, are gonna be uh, in charge of the sales floor. Yes, you're doing sales now. Trevor's back. Watch TV. Brandy Stumple. 
I'm over here in chat. Oh, never mind. The cashier and sales. Isaac? What are you doing? I'm doing quite a bit of sales today. Still kind of breaking even though. I haven't even restocked. Everything that we have sold. Alright. Well, poor Trevor to take a break. And I will be the cashier. What's Nick looking for? There's even the purpose of these fancy couches if you can't even sit on them. Alright. All right, you're gonna take a break and you are going to find a restock. All right, Vic, make yourself a sandwich. Make a group of cereal. Not cereal. Sandwiches. No, you don't have to set. I need this. We Back inside the... Employee office, please. All right. 
Camera is... Appreciate admire. Um, you're doing an excellent job, Tamara. You may go home for the day. Vic. All right, it is 6 p.m. We're going to close. Thick. Send your employee home. And Vic's here late. I'm trying to send you home, Troy. I guess not. Alright, sent home for the day. Oh. No. Clean up everything. <laughs> oh, he's still hungry. Just, just clean it up, man. Clean up, clean up, clean up. And then walk home. Wow, he is here really late. Is home in 13 hours. Well, Natasha, you've got all the time in the world. Well, it's a stocking day for you, so you're going to be making plates. That is what the people want. They want plates. Lots of plates. Resume making the plate. Ooh, that's a nice painting. in the inventory. Start on another painting. Knit. Perfect poof.
knit products. Another poop. Products. Oof. Oh. Another planted hanger. All right, now let's have her get some leftovers. Of her favorite grilled cheese. Yes, girl, we got you. It's actually doing pretty well for energy today. Oh, this painting again. Let's grab that painting. Try it again. Is that Vic walking in? Walk up to him and give him a romantic kiss. She might have missed you a little bit. How are Vic's needs? They could be better. And now all we're doing is waiting for... The clock to turn to fall. Then we will be done. Everyone's a day older. That reminds me. He's older, Vic. Wolf is here. One, two, three, four. That's one year. Five to thirty-nine. One, two. Three, losing to forty six, thirty nine, aging, Vic, forty three, and thirty nine. That makes sense. Okay. This has been. The Una family. I am going to change the names. How do I do that? Names. First name to a last name. Ugh. Uh, I'll figure it out later. Anyway, this has been Natasha Una and Vic Vector. They are now married and are two pretty successful, well, probably more moderately successful business owners. And 
that is that. Next time on Desert Rada Valley, we will be playing the last family of round eight, which is Julian Cook. And our goal with him is to get him to marry the restaurant owner. Well, the take and go restaurant owner. So I'd like to thank everyone for coming by tonight and chatting. Thanks to Blind Ayame and Magic Toad for following. And I hope to see you all back tomorrow night. Have a good night.